grade 11 geography lesson 3 let's continue to practice with these questions question number 36 why Copan climate classification method is commonly used a because of his strong sunshine quantity observation b due to his cloud cover support c because of the straightforward and the quantitative method d due to his strong observation towards climate of the mountainous and fog effect regions so why the Köppen climate classification method is commonly used is due to his straightforward and the quantifiable method so the answer is c Question number 37. Which of the following is not correct? Atmospheric mass travels from high pressure to lower pressure areas. B. Subtropical high migrate south during the winter and north during the summer in the northern hemisphere. C. The seas are cooler than the continents during the summer in the northern hemisphere. D. Denser maritime air Denser maritime air that rests above the oceans helps to rise and creating a strong subtropical highs for winter so the answer is d not during the winter but during the summer question number 38 which of the following is correct about the mediterranean climate a precipitation is primarily dominate the region in the winter due to polar cyclone effect b precipitation is primarily reacts the re reach the region in summer due to mid latitude cyclone c precipitation comes to the region in the winter due to the mid latitude cyclone d the equatorial westerly wind is the dominant for the region during the winter okay the mediterranean climate is known with having moist wind during the winter so precipitation is primarily dominate the region in the winter due to polar cyclone it says no Due to this cyclones. Another B says that precipitation is primarily reach the region in summer due to the mid latitude cyclone. It says no, not in summer. Precipitation comes to the region in the winter due to the mid latitude cyclone. Yes, the answer is C. The equatorial western reach is not. Okay. Another question number 39. Which of the following is not the feature of mid latitude desert climate region? A. Mid latitude desert climate region. Low relative humidity in the cloud cover. Low frequency and volume of precipitation. Moderate to high average monthly temperature. Continental air masses is the main source of precipitation for the region. So the answer is D. 
Question number 14. All of the following is the characteristics of dry desert climate region. Except 1. Or A. Low relative humidity and the cloud cover. B. Low frequency and amount of precipitation. C. Low monthly and the daily temperatures and the strong velocity. D. High mean annual temperature. There is high monthly and the daily temperatures with a strong wind velocity. So the answer is C. Question number 41. Which of the following is correct? A. The difference in the length from December to June is larger for the areas found closer to the equator. B. The difference in day length from December to June is smaller for the place closer to the high latitude. C. The, in June, the daylight covers more than half of any parallel latitude in northern and southern hemisphere. D. In December, In December, in December, more than half of any latitude in the northern hemisphere is in darkness, but southern hemisphere is in sunshine in december more than half of any latitude in northern hemisphere is in darkness but the southern hemisphere is in sunshine what the question says that which of the following is correct okay a the difference in day lengths from december to june is larger for areas found closer to the equator no not larger but smaller okay larger makes it incorrect b the difference in the length from december to june is smaller for places closer to high latitude not for high latitude places closer to the low latitude equator another june is the daylight covers covers more than half of any parallel latitude in the northern and the southern hemisphere what makes it wrong is and the southern hemisphere not characterizes with the same daylights in different hemispheres so in december more than half of any latitude in the northern hemisphere is darkness but the southern hemisphere is in sunshine so the correct answer is d question number 42 Ambo and Awash are found on the same latitude of 9 degree latitude, but their temperature is strictly different. This is due to the influence of A. Distance from the sea B. Rotation of the earth C. Latitude D. Altitude The difference or the variety of topography between Two different areas of the same latitude is results with different temperature. This is due to the different topography, which is altitude. Question number 30, 43. If the area's driest months had precipitation of less than 0.74 inches, what will be the climatic region? A. Tropical wet and dry or savanna. 
B. Tropical monsoon desert climate. Tropical monsoon climate. C. Tropical wet or equatorial rainforest climate. D. Dry climates. F. The driest areas. Rainfall or precipitation is less than 0 0.74. The areas or the climatic area is known as uh, tropical wet and dry savanna. A. Of the following alternatives, which one is incorrect? A. Extremely continental areas more quickly heats and cool down than the huge water bodies. Inland locations have wider temperature ranges than coastal locations. Large water bodies storing massive amounts of energy during the hotter summer and releasing energy quickly to the atmosphere during the cooler winter. D. Large water bodies storing massive amounts of energy during the hotter summer and slowly releasing to the atmosphere during the cooler winter. So the incorrect is C. What makes it C is that they never releasing energy quickly but slowly. Question number 46. All of the following are the key elements that govern the distribution of world climate, except A. Latitude B. Atmospheric circulation C. Weather change of the day D. Corelius effect So, latitude, altitude, atmospheric circulation, ocean circulation, Correlates effect, revolution, rotation of the Earth are the major factors affecting the distribution of world climate. But C is not correct. Thank you, students, for your attention. Thank you. Don't forget to observe and share, like, comment, and subscribe. Goodbye.